17 photos. When my mother was admitted to the skilled nursing facility, she'd had aphasia for many years. She couldn't find her words, and having a conversation with her was difficult. I had the idea to use old photos from her parents, the house where she grew up, her childhood friend, or a wedding photo, as a means to try and make contact with her again. The 17 photos were in a postcard format, with the name of the people in the photo printed at the bottom, collected in a wooden cigar box. Whenever we, the family, or the caregivers brought out the pictures, my mother always reacted very positively, even proudly. As time went on, her memory began to fade, and this was clear by how she reacted to the photos. One day, she looked at her wedding photo and was angry. She placed her hand on top of my father, who she'd been married to for 50 years, and yelled, He has to go! But the photo of her childhood friend she reacted quite differently to. When she saw this photo, she suddenly seemed much younger and was like a teenager in love. I saw with my own eyes how she looked at the photo lovingly, gave it a bunch of kisses, and then held it wistfully to her heart. In her last year of life, I went back to the pictures and showed her a picture of her mother. No response. I tried several times. Come on, Ma. You know who that is, don't you? She angrily replied, No, you know better than me. No. She no longer knew who the 50-year-old woman in the picture was, and the angry reply was her way of denying it. Then she closed her eyes, by which she undoubtedly meant to say, and stop it now, okay? I still treasure those 17 photos. Talking About Things is a project by the Lucas School of Arts, the Flanders Centre of Expertise on Dementia, the Regional Centre of Expertise MEMO, VVSG, and the University of Louvre with support by the Flemish government, Flanders' Care. The project Talking About Things was inspired by an exhibition model developed by the Enable Foundation.